So a few days ago, I asked some of my viewers to send me packs I could review for a video. Fortunately, I only got three, but that's okay. So in today's video, I'll be rating all three of them. Also guys, subscribe and join the Discord. I'm almost close to 400, and you'll be supporting my channel, so thank you. But enjoy the video. Alright chat, so the first texture pack is called Goo Pack Beta. This is good swords, nice by Spruce here as you can see. Alright, so as the title says, it just has short swords, nothing much, nothing armor or anything. But the swords actually look nice. I like these, I like slighty, I like these slighty, like, what's it called? Slighted, slighted swords like that, you know, like slighty pointy and stuff like that. That's how I like them. I like swords like this. But this is pretty awesome, man. Look at this. Look at all this stuff. Look at all these swords. Everything, man. Like, look at all of this. Look at all of this, man. This is actually nice. I do like the little color. I like the little colors in there. That's actually a little nice touch. I don't know why, but I actually like that. And here I have a diamond pickaxe. The pickaxes are also short and they are very passable. I would actually use this for like a sword. My, my rating for this would probably be a good 6 out of 10. It's not, there's not really much into it other armor wise, but this is it. But like for survival and PvP, this is pretty good. This is like a pretty good texture pack, sword and stuff. But yeah, it does give it the name. So actually, you know let's bump that up to a 7 out of 10. 7 out of 10. It's great. You can use this for PvP and survival. It's great. It's perfect enough, man. I mean, this texture pack rarely has anything, it's just short swords. That's why it makes this look great. 7 out of 10. If there was more, that would have been great. I don't know. Also, yeah, and also, oh wait, actually, hold on, never mind, chat. Golden apples are actually better, chat. Can I get a win with this pack? I am very trash, chat. I've not played Cubecraft, Cubecraft duels in a while, man. Yep, you can tell. I can't gap one up. Okay, yep, I can gap one time. Okay, come on, chat. Also, I do gotta give the color on the on the golden apples. They're actually looking pretty decent. Oh my god, chat. Why am I doing so bad today? Okay, GG. I barely won that, chat. I barely won that. Dad, I barely won that chat. I barely won that. Wow. So I'm surprised I won that. All right. So for the next resource pack, I'm using currently Gem V2 version version Gem version 2 16x made by Misik 16. This was recommended by me by Soccer Gaming. So Soccer Gaming, if you're seeing this, comment down so they can know you. All right. So first of all, I've seen these ores before, and they look alright. These are some ores I've seen before. Diff a little bit of different color, but I've seen the ores before. They're the ores and F for item frames. Now they really didn't do much over here. Nothing for any of these items, but the armor they did. Um, looks like the chainmail armor has nothing. I don't know. They probably got lazy at, at the chainmail armor. But over here, yeah, the chainmail armor did get like some redesign. All right, so the apples, golden carrots, they all look different. I do love the enchant though. Look at that enchant. That enchant actually looks cool. Then we have all these items. I gotta give it to them. I like the emeralds and the diamonds. They all look nice. Look at that. Now to the main part, the tools. Pickaxes a lot. There's actually a lot here. Look at the pickaxes. I don't really like that curve, but it looks interesting. The potion bottles or the XP bottles don't really have much, but they do keep the enchant glint, which is beautiful. And to the best part, the swords. I actually like the swords. I like the rules design. They actually look cool. Also, the crosshair in the middle actually looks awesome. Here we have the bow and a uh, fishing rod. I thought this was a crossbow, but no, apparently this is a fishing rod, which is interesting. Oh man, it looks like a crossbow a bit for me. Out of all, I might have to give this pack a good 7 out of 10. All right, bro. Look at my armor, man. That looks interesting. Look, that looks nice, man. It looks interesting. Okay, I don't know if I'm going to win this one. I'm pretty sure this guy, this guy looks pretty better. Yep. Look at me, chat. I'm losing. I'm losing this one. Yep. I'm like two hearts down. I don't know how many hearts does he have. 4.5. Okay, he rehealed. That's not a good idea. You should never rehealed. I'm good. I'm good like that. Hit, hit, hit. Frick, I'm gonna get comp. I'm getting clapped here, chat. I'm getting clapped. Five hearts. He's. I'm on five. He's on five hearts. He, I only have four. How? How is he? Has he hit me better? Wait, how much hearts is he, is he on? One point five. Yes, yes. Die, die, die. How did I'm, none of my hits count? None of my hits count there. That is so dumb. I'm lagging out. <laughs> okay. Oh my god. All right. Okay. That this pack is getting like a good seven out of ten, though. All right. So this is the last texture pack. This one actually is called. This is Alanon's 2K texture pack. Just surprising. So I've seen these ones before. I do love the color shading. I do gotta give the green. Obviously, I love that green. The blue, nice. Here's the ores and picture frames. He added a little. He added a little X lotto here, which uh, it's all right. Got the emeralds looking pretty nice. Ores, I do like the redesign of the ores. I think the coal looks the same. I don't know, that's me. But here comes, here's the apples, man. That actually looks nice. I do love that little inch anglet. That inch anglet just looks perfect. Now, if we go here to the armor, the armor, you can see that they redesigned it. I don't know if the leather looks a bit redesigned. Looks the same, though. But yeah, you can tell there's a few differences. He also added axolotls to the things. I'm not really much of a fan of adding axolotls and stuff here. Now, yeah, you can tell, you can totally tell there's a little difference in bottles, but yeah, the XP bottles do look a little different, but the, the inch hand glint. And then here's the pickaxes. I actually like these pickaxes. I would love a texture pack with these pickaxes by themselves, because that actually looks nice. Now, the swords, they're all right. Uh, you know, I'm more of a tip slanted guy, but this actually looks nice, man. It actually looks nice. And the bow and the fixture rod, that's just all beautiful. I want to say this texture pack looks pretty good for survival. This pack, texture pack is very good for survival, so I'm going to give it 8 out of 10. 
Uh, I only missed a point because I don't like the swords. I'm more of a slip pointed guy and the crosshair, not my favorite crosshair. But for PvP, this is beautiful. Eight out of ten. I'm not gonna lie, I do gotta give it to Awesome Gamer, which I'm pretty sure made this pack for Alanon. But I gotta give it to him. He's like, he did a pretty good job with this weakness. Oh, freak. I have to get this, man. He's gonna drop slowness or something. Oh, there you go. There it is. You did not. Okay, now you actually do something. You actually hit me. Look for there's milk for money, buddy. Okay, I'm definitely gonna die here. Five hearts. Oh, GG, man. All right, but those are all the packs I ranked. Uh, I'd say Alanon's pack will get a good eight out of ten. It looks good for survival and it looks good for PvP. Which one's the best pack? I'm gonna say Alanon's pack first. There's more time to it. But yeah, if you guys want me to do a part two of me ranking more of my viewers' texture packs, uh, go join my Discord and send them there. And also, guys, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Please subscribe. That's basic meanie. I'm out.